Microsoft just wrapped up its press conference at Gamescom to kick things off, and Danny O'Dwyer, you just got to play Forza Motorsport 6. Forza! 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 <laughs> hey man, we've been in Gamescom, we've been here in Cologne, beautiful Germany, uh, for, you know, 12 hours or so. You know what's been the, big, the, the most impressive thing I've seen since I got here? Scale man. Nope. Puddles. Uh, oh, puddles. All yeah. the puddles outside. Our feet were <laughs> totally drenched. We've all got umbrellas. And it turns out Forza Motorsport 6 has been inspired by Gamescom and has some sick puddles in it, yo. Yeah, that was the focus of the entire presentation for the game. And, yeah. and I'm wondering, as someone who's played the series for years, I mean, is this something you've been waiting for? Like, does it feel like this is worth a new iteration, mm. a new full retail game? I love racing games, I love playing a variety of racing games, I love F1, I'm playing loads of project cars, and I like the Forza games as well. And Rain has always been like involved in racing games. But it's generally been this kind of, okay, the track is wet, which means you've got less grip. Yes. And then that sort of had this sort of like even uh, change to everything in the car, to grip, to like how hot the tires get, all that it sort of like stuff. It was like a binary switch, it wasn't really nuanced. Exactly, it wasn't like there were certain parts of the track that had more water, what you might call a puddle. Well, Forza Motorsport 6, or <clears throat> Forza Motorsport 6, man, it's got puddles. And when Dan Greenwald gets up on a stage and starts talking about puddles, it's easy to be, like, pretty flippant about it, you know. Sure. For God's sake, they're just puddles. It's actually pretty great. Okay, but let me play devil's advocate here. Okay. Is this not something that could just be added to Forza Motorsport 5 as DLC? I mean, there's got to be more to this. <laughs> than just puddles, right? Well, they've got a bunch more cars, got a bunch more circuits. Sure. Uh, today All I things that can be done with DLC. That's true. Uh, hey, that we can get a conversation <laughs> about FIFA and Madden, we, or Call of Duty, we'll be here all day long. Um, the one thing I will say is that it is definitely something new I'm um, experiencing in a driving game. Okay. So I was playing a brand, Brands Hatch, so I'm driving up like one of the, the like easier corners in the dry, right? You sort of you come out of a, a sharp left-hander, and it's uphill, and it's like a little crested right, and you can generally like, dry track you can hit it real fast yeah. you can hit it over the top but there's this puddle that's accumulated on the side of the road right and when you dra ram into it at full speed even like the driving line will tell you slow down here it like pulls one side of the car off and this is interesting for two reasons one because it makes you not maybe like take time with that corner a bit two it also maybe makes you be a bit gutsy if you've got a slow lap. Maybe you'll just push into it and try and correct it on the other side. But perhaps the most interesting part of it is what they, when you come out of a corner, there are some corners in circuits that you can come out of dirty because you know you haven't got a really tough corner coming up for sure. a while. So you can kind of like mess up the gear and like you have the back squiggling out a bit. If there's a puddle on that corner and your back is going, it's gonna like overemphasize that even more. So that's what happened to me. I went up the top, I turned this corner, I was kind of losing the back end of it and I saw it, I was like, oh, I'll be fine. And I hit this thing, puddles, man, into the barrier. Hit rewind, take a little bit better on that corner. Turns out puddles made me a better driver. Would you do that again? Puddles. I like it. I hope. I hope they have re uh, wet rain for as many tracks as possible. Um, obviously, I'm excited the Formula E cars are going to be in uh, this year's game. Well, I haven't got a chance to play them yet, so that's pretty exciting. There's a bunch more uh, tracks Circuit of the Americas in this year's game. Um, Sonoma Raceway, which we're familiar with in the Bay Area. Uh, uh, Monza's also been added as well. So there's you know, more tracks, more cars, more puddles, more Forza. More Forza. All right, stay tuned to more coverage for Gamescom with GameSpot.com. Oh!